Hey guys, this is Daniel from CNC Labs. I'm standing in front of the latest revision of the alt mill. Extrusions have been redesigned. They now have a little catchment feature for the drag chains, some webbing now across its center, and you'll also note a bunch of little mounds, essentially Y-axis rail. These actually have their own integrated flange. We now have redesigned the jointry so that the machine is up assembled upside down once with the table legs put on and flipped only once. Very clean wiring now. This was generally one of the highest requested changes for the alt mill for new revisions was to clean up the wiring a bit. You'll only have to run one single harness that will be your motor power, motor signal, and limit switch cable all in one pre-braided harness. That just makes it a lot easier to route all your wiring and whatnot. Molded covers will just take the uh, rear exiting cables and reroute them 180 degrees, provide them some cable strain relief, and they'll actually screw on to the back of the motor and physically, mechanically lock the connectors in place. You'll see a new revised SLB EXT controller enclosure. We're also going to be implementing a new crossbeam screw type. So this is now a customized screw that has a really tall head, and it'll basically prevent you from potentially dropping the screw into the extrusion. Obviously, we take a lot of our customer feedback. So hopefully you'll enjoy all these small improvements with the Alt Mill Mark II. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.